Okay, we're back to the last part of the barbecue. And that's for the ribs. The time has gone off on these meat ribs. Have the meat ribs set at 145. Um, for the internal temp. So I'm going to pull out that probe. Bring that one over. Ooh. that one over. Get them wrapped up. So they stay hot. When they're finished cooking inside. The internal temperature will still be going. I'll turn off the meat probe. I take this. Stick it out in there and let it get Still keep cooking. Gonna let all that yummy goodness in those ribs continue to cook for about another 15-20 minutes before I slice into it and I'll be back when they do that so you can see how they came out okay we've let these ribs set for at least 20 minutes so now to open them up I'm going to take off the first rack of ribs right, there, right here and place them on the cutting board we'll wrap, rewrap them up Keep them nice and warm. And we'll slice into this a couple of slices. That smells delicious. Mmm. Mmm. I love that crust. That's so good. That's what it looks like with the core temperature on beef ribs at 145 degrees. You can see the perfect smoke ring in there. And how just... How much juice and everything comes out of it. That is just flavorful. The crust is good. That's just exceptional. So I'm gonna take this one here that has a good smoke ring to it. it has a nice little bite of spice in there, which I like. That's mainly bone on this one. I slice that one to where it's basically bone. Those are good. Has a candied brown sugar candied flavor to it. Taste of black pepper. Plus the spices. And this is the one that I had to marinate in the spices. Came out really good. Beef ribs are just phenomenal the way it, where they are. I hope you like this. If you do, click, uh, 
give me a thumbs up, a comment down below. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe and hit the bell icon. And I'll see you later.